They say that if you stand exactly halfway between two bombs, you won't be harmed when they explode because the shockwaves from both sides will cancel each other out. But can that really save your life? To find out, the rumor testing team went to a surface blast testing range and decided to run a shockwave cancellation experiment. Surface explosions make it easier to observe how shockwaves move, so Adam first demonstrated by dropping two stones into the lake at the same time. The ripples from each side meet at the center. If the rumor is true, the pressure at that meeting point should be noticeably lower than at other locations. Next, Jimmy brought together 5.5 pounds of TNT, and Adam built a floating platform out of wooden boards for the explosives, drilling a small hole every foot across the platform. They did this so pressure sensors could be mounted at the water surface without being damaged by the blast. First, they planned to perform a single explosion baseline test. Once the sensors recorded pressure values at various distances from that blast, they would then detonate charges on both sides simultaneously to see whether the pressures where the shockwaves crossed would add up, cancel out, or remain unchanged. They placed the floating platform in the center of the lake, and the experts secured the 5.5 pound charge at a point 40 inches from the platform's center. With everything in position, they began the control test.